January 20th, 2019, and I am still laying in bed at 11.30 because today is my day off and I don't have anything going on today, um, so it's really exciting. I still have Bailey in bed with me though. Hi Bailey. She doesn't want to be bothered. I'm not sure what I'm going to do today, but my mom says I should start vlogging just to see how that goes. So, I guess I should get up and get my day started. It is kind of late. You want to go upstairs? Mama can make some coffee and we can have breakfast at 11.30 in the morning. Yeah? You want to get up? You're giving me no expression whatsoever. At least you're cute. So this is how we're starting today in my Christmas pajamas. And I guess my hair is still kind of fresh. I got it cut yesterday. So it's still sort of clean. I don't know, but I probably need to do laundry <laughs> and clean today, but <sighs> let's get today started. nothing mm -hmm. here but I'll, I'll open the door for you so you can see see there's no one there not even a bird or squirrel do you just want to go outside you want to go outside and see because um, I don't want to go out there sure okay go go on mm. Bailey go I thought you really wanted to go outside I'm not going that is so much snow. I think Bailey is like instantly regretting her decision. Bailey. <laughs> Bailey, what are you doing? Oh my God, let me get my shoes and jacket on. What is it? Did you find something? Bailey, I swear to God, I have a feeling you're going to pee on the concrete. Do you want me to throw you into this big pile of snow? Huh? You want me to throw you in some snow? I know you would just love that. We live at the end of the cul-de-sac, so they always put like the, um, all the snow from the street in our yard, which is... The best, if you can see they do it for this little bit. I feel like our pile's bigger. All right, I guess Bailey's done snooping around. Oh, I see there's another dog over there. That's what she was freaking out about. Bailey, you didn't even go see the other dog. You can see how cute I look. <laughs> Bailey, you didn't even go see the other dog. Oh well. Okay, you ready to go inside? Cause it's, you know, really cold. Yeah. Okay, okay. What are you doing, pretty girl? Oh. Oh, okay. Right when we get inside. What's that? Is that your toy? Is that your toy? Oh. Oh. Oh, sweet baby. Drop it.
sometimes when Bailey has like way too much energy for me, I will throw her toy down the stairs into the basement. So she has to run up and down the stairs. Ah! Bailey! Okay, come on. See, look. She already knows. <laughs> Come back. Oh. Bailey, I haven't even had my coffee yet. I haven't had my coffee. Okay. Yeah, kisses. We don't bite. We just give kisses. No biting. Do my hands taste good? No. Oh. oh, okay. Pretty girl. What are you doing, pretty girl? <laughs> like, Mama, I'm not used to you taking this many videos of me. No. No. Okay. I want to go drink some coffee and like watch some TV and make breakfast. Okay? I know you're going to stand in there and want some bacon grease because you know I'm making bacon. Oh, good morning, Opie. Look at that pretty boy. Are you hungry? Probably. Here, Opie, come on to the top. Come on. name is Opal. I named him Opie. Well, when he was younger, he looked like an opal. Um, he's got like a bunch of different colors. He's kind of like iridescent, like an opal. So we just call him Opie for short. Yeah. make my keto coffee. Oh. I've just been using this like sugar-free syrup. This is like Christmas cookie flavor. It's so good. Only do a tablespoon of that. And then heavy whipping cream. Oh yay, Bailey, you're eating breakfast. I don't even know how much of this I put in. Oh, please. So milk frother. Kind of mix everything together, makes it like a like a latte because I just have my little Keurig. birdie feet, but oh my gosh, look at all that snow. This is what we're having for breakfast today. I 
I usually always eat a whole avocado because I do eat keto, so I don't eat any carbs. Well, really low carbs, no bread or anything. Um, so I eat a lot of fat, being avocado, three pieces of bacon, and two eggs, and coffee, of course. Um, so this is pretty standard for me. Oh, and the seasoning I put on this is the Everything But The Bagel seasoning. I got it from Trader Joe's. It is amazing. I use it for everything. I love it on my avocados. Hi, baby. Today is Mommy and Bailey Day. We just hang out and do nothing, except for we're gonna sort of be productive and do laundry here in a little bit. But we're just taking a little break from eating after we're done with breakfast. Yeah. Okay, so it's like one o'clock now, almost 1.30. And I am like washing my face for the first time today. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my face and I wanted to go ahead and include my skincare routine in this vlog just because I haven't done one in a while. Um, a skin routine video anyway. Uh, so even though I'm washing my face for the first time at 1.30 in the afternoon, I'm still going to be washing my face twice a day and everybody should be doing that. So for... So before I start washing my face, I'm gonna wash my hands with soap and water. You should always be washing your hands with soap and water anytime before you're gonna touch your face. I mean, I don't have breakouts, but it makes it significantly worse if you start touching your face with dirty hands. So gross. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and wet my face. Oh. Okay. And I have like, oh, I don't know, like six cleansers that I use. So I think I'm just gonna use this one today. Um, first thing in the morning is this um, liquid face soap. It's the mild one by Clinique. Just get a little bit in my hands. Probably do this for a good minute or so. Okay. Rinse that off. And then after you cleanse your skin, you always want to tone. I've been using the Clinique Number no. 2 Clarifying Lotion. Put it on a cotton pad. Uh, toning your skin after you cleanse neutralizes uh, the pH balance of your skin. Um, this one also happens to exfoliate. like a mild, mild exfoliation that you can do every day, even twice a day. This does have alcohol in it, which a lot of people freak out about alcohol being in their products and they want like alcohol free. I don't, I think your skin needs a little bit of alcohol. So this has like witch hazel and this is a menthol one. So it just feel a little cooling on the skin, which I really like. Okay, and then after that's all dry, I've been using this vitamin E. Um, it's like an essence lotion. I just put, I got this at TJ Maxx, I don't know. I just wanted something with, I really want a vitamin E oil. Then I found this. It's, I don't really notice a huge difference with it, but it says this improves the efficacy of your other products that you use, which means that it intensifies the it intensifies the other ones or makes them more work better, I guess. It's just the best way I can think of to explain it. Okay. And then I totally let that one dry. Um, I don't have a serum that I'm using in the morning right now, 
but I am going to grab some moisture surge. I guess I'm just using a lot of Clinique stuff right now. So I get just a little bit of that. Just a little bit of that. And then um, I've been grabbing... I use the Moisture Surge as like an added moisturizer. I don't use it as the only moisturizer because I feel like I would, for as expensive as this is, I felt like I was going through it like so fast. Um, and you know, girls gotta use her skincare wisely because she's not trying to spend a million dollars on all her skincare. Um, but I use this, I add this to that because uh, this is just like a daily, like everyday moisturizer that's really good. And um. It's good for sensitive skin, which I feel like I don't really have sensitive skin, but I feel like I have acne prone skin. So I put this everywhere. And then the one thing that I still use from Trader Joe's that I actually still really like is this lotion that has SPF in it. I mean, I really mostly just use it for the SPF and I always wear that every single day. Put it on only in the morning because you don't really need it at night. I should always be wearing SPF every single day. And then I've been using eye cream because I'm trying to prevent wrinkles, even though I don't really have any wrinkles right now. I do have like some creases like under my eye, but that's just how my eyes are. Um, my friend, who's also an esthetician, gave me a sample of It's Potent by Benefit. Uh, it's an eye cream. And I've been using it for just under a week. This, I think tomorrow will be a week. So you just need the littlest bit because you're not putting it all over your face. Put it on your ring fingers. Just. You always wanna tap because if you start pulling, you could be creating wrinkles. Who wants that? And that's it. So that is my skincare routine, at least for the morning. And then evening, I have like a nice serum sample that I have that I'm using. Um, and sometimes I'll do like an exfoliation at night, um, like a couple times a week, but not all the time. And I should probably do masks more often than I do, but I just, I don't think to do it, even though I have so many masks. I have so many. Like, I have sheet masks, clay masks. I don't know. All right, so now that my face is all cleansed, moisturized, toned, all that good stuff, I am gonna go do some laundry. This is the monstrosity that we are dealing with today. So I'm going to pull this into my room and I'm going to separate it all out. I don't even know. Do I really need to separate laundry? I don't know, but I'm going to do it and then I'll, I guess I'll take you guys with me. I'm going to be watching YouTube videos, so I'll probably just fast forward through all this, but you can see whatever.
blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I'm having a really good time organizing and cleaning everything. Sorry I'm not really talking that much, but you're getting to see some real life stuff. Oh, my lazy day. But I'm having, yeah, I'm having a good day. Little baby. She's hanging out over there in the middle of my pillows, which she knows I hate, but because it's a lazy day, I'm letting it happen. I want to make my bed, but like, I feel like I might be crawling into bed to like watch tons of videos or Netflix, YouTube, whatever, here in a little bit. So like, if I make my bed, I won't want to lay in it. And I like, I need to be lazy today. <sighs> what am I gonna do? The struggle is so real. It is so real. I did clean up my vanity. I'm so happy. This goes, needs to go in my bathroom. Uh, these brushes and things I need to clean because they have creams on them. Um, so I need to clean them before I use them again, but I'm just a happy camper. And everything's all nice and organized. I don't even wanna talk about that. Um, but yeah, yay. And then I put my plants, I brought my plants back into my room because uh, they were not there because I had a Christmas tree there. So, you know, I just I wanted to bring some green back into my room because I just don't have a lot of, I don't know, letting things just like make my space prettier. I don't know, just they bring life to a space. So that's just what we're doing right now. chilling we're watching a Jaclyn Hill video while I'm actually uploading some videos from well this vlog I'm trying to go ahead and start editing it because I'm not doing anything we're having the most exciting most relaxing day it's so nice and my room is clean so it's like super actually relaxing because I don't know about you but I cannot relax in like a dirty space so when stuff's like actually clean I'm just like so happy so anyway um that's what's happening right now nothing exciting but it is exciting you know what i mean okay so i'm actually already done editing everything that we've done today <laughs> which i'm so sorry it's already at freaking 27 minutes but the sun's going down which means it's what mm, 5 45 pretty accurate um, we need to go make some dinner since we didn't really eat lunch. Bebe, Bailey, are you hungry? Do you want some dinner? You know you want some dinner. She says, no, I'd rather just lay here next to you all day, every day. So like, I don't even know what to make for dinner today. Seriously, what I've been eating for dinner, like almost every single night I've had like either a burger, which I had last night, and then like two nights ago, and then the night before last, I had nachos with pork rinds, and I'm just like stuck in a dinner rut, and I guess that's okay, but uh, I don't know if I want to get something else. <sighs> I guess I'll just have to go look in the fridge and freezer, see what I have, and I don't know, but I'm, I'm just, I'm hungry now, so I need to eat something. <laughs> Are you hungry, 
Sorry, I wanted to get my food in the oven before I got you your food. Okay. I'm making nachos <laughs> really no surprise there um, but I am having Brussels sprouts too so and I'm making um, barbecue chicken nachos with and it has sriracha and some bacon crack on it this it's the bacon crack is this thing that my stepmom got me for Christmas she said she got it at a farmers market it's by divine swine delicious I've been putting it on everything including like homemade pizza and that's really the only thing that comes to mind right now but like I've been putting it on a lot of stuff and it's good so I like bacon a lot what can I say yes I love nachos so much oh yes looks so good. I just don't want to burn my mouth, so I'm not going to eat it right away, but oh, yes. Hmm. So I am going to be making some cheesecake fat bombs. Um, I guess this is a video of them making it, but it um, seems fairly easy. Um, I actually have all of that stuff, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started and I'll fast forward you guys and see we won't be stuck watching every single bit. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started. silicone things I just have the metal thing so I'm like literally having to scrape them out so they didn't turn out that pretty but I've tasted a couple of them and they I mean 
They taste fine. Um, so I'm still waiting for these to cool um, so I can drizzle some chocolate on them. But other than that, we're done. So now that my laundry's like kind of sort of starting to get done, I'm gonna be responsible and put it away. So proud of myself. I feel so close, you're far from catching you. I'm on my toes so I can reach for you. I feel so close, you're far from catching you. I'm on my toes so I can reach for you. She got this promotion and this job before she actually uh, finished uh, everything that she needed to get her license. So now she's certified. So, um, but she's the MAC consultant at the Ulta there in Brighton, Michigan. So if you guys are in Brighton and you happen to go into Ulta and you see a girl with bright pink hair, uh, yeah, that's my daughter Jewel. Anyway, I, I have yet to go. I'm on my toes so I can reach for you I'm reaching, I'm reaching, I'm reaching for you I'm reaching, I'm reaching So in that last clip um, when I'm folding laundry and I like slow it down for so you can hear what I'm listening to it's my mom my mom is so sweet. She's um, she makes a lot of videos of, about me. She's uh, she does scrapbooking. Come here, baby. She makes scrapbook page videos about you too, baby. Sometimes when Mama sends pictures of you to her. Yeah. Why don't you want to come cuddle? Why don't you want to cuddle me? Anyway, my mom is really sweet. Talking about me on her on her channel on her YouTube channel, so yeah, I love her. She's just so sweet. Okay, so I'm finishing up editing this video because I guess I'm gonna end up posting it tonight because I don't have anything going on. You guys haven't seen my days; just so exciting. Um, but I just got a text from my dad saying that there's like a something going on with the moon tonight so I think baby I need to go check that out by baby and I going outside I really just mean me because Bailey probably won't want to come because it's so cold um, so let's go check out the moon okay quite tell what's going on with the moon because it's like I don't know part of it's covered but it looks like it could be covered by a cloud so I don't know I don't know dad it's really too cold for me to be standing outside for longer than a few seconds so I'm back inside. Well, now that I'm back in bed after being outside for a few seconds and freezing my ass off, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog for the day because it is like, I don't know, It's I know it's after 10 o'clock and I'm tired. Um, I probably will like watch Netflix and stuff and be just as boring as I have been all day. Um, but anyway, if you guys hung around for this whole video, uh, make sure to give it a thumbs up and leave comments for things that you might have ideas of things I can do. I don't know. If you think there's some cool things I could do instead of all of the lame stuff I did today, let me know.
All right, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.